Sergio. Well, there's a taste of the sort of pace that he can create from nothing. Oh, brilliant. Tennis from Roger. A test a such a temptation to use it and play. So, don't you think for those youngsters wanting to learn to become good centre and in Houston? Lovely touch. So three one. Game Federer. And that certainly won't come back. Three two. How's that for accuracy? Tremendous approach. Forehand moved around. And he played last year. Yeah. I'm just thinking what terrific improvement he's made since then when he lost him. by Roddick, that was nice. And this is really what's wrong with Roddick's net play. He picks up a beautiful half volley here on the service line, right here, and look what he does. He remains on the service line and therefore vulnerable to the cross court. So a glorious hitter at the ball from the back of the court. World in their years. Turning junior. Good ball for tennis from Roger Federer. Played that they so appreciated him. No question about that, it was a heroic. Better volume now, he's better up. Moves so easily to it, doesn't he? Four, three, better up. Play by Roger Federer, and I think he's doing something very smart. He's hitting an unusual number of sliced backhands to keep the ball low to minimize the power. <laughs> 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 
It looks so ridiculously easy. Game better. Oh, what a good game that was. Game better. Very competent service game there. shot the backhand of Federer and the temper of Roderick of uh, Roddick quite apparent now as he goes a breakdown 3-2 second set all managed match game and that underlining Empress and my and Federer, uh, rather Ferreira. Oh, that a dream shot! And he runs marathons. Beautiful backhand under some pressure. Thirty on. Sure, Roger would just as soon wrap this match up this game because Roddick is so dangerous. Yeah. Well, that's lovely work from Federer and deserves the applause. He made a late move to the net, and uh, that one was really set up. And Roger anticipated well. Two points from the match. And that dreamlike backhand, which throughout the match has been hitting winner after winner. And that'll do it. So, with the seventh ace of the day, Roger Federer moves smoothly through to tomorrow's final to play Juan Ignacio Chela of Argentina. 7 6, six 4 It's taken him an hour and 21 minutes. And he'll be pretty pleased, I think, with the way he played. <laughs>